Hey yo everyone, this is a Happy Animate Cafe Manager here with another walkthrough episode for for the game Pokemon Moon. Okay, so I kind of settled for for my Aerodactyl. Jolly Nature happened to be female, by the way, but my biggest disappointment is that the IVs are terrible. Attack hat is 1, speed is 6. I mean, it just su It just sucks Norlax balls. But at least it's, wor it's worth breeding. Sort of. I mean, I just gotta find another Pokemon that's either Jolly or Adamant, and that has some good IVs. IVs are definitely its A group. Aerodactyl is a fast Pokemon. I wonder how you use its speed in battle. Yeah, I'm gonna save game right here because I'm a little happy with with the nature, but not the IVs. Did you find her? Yes, and Hapu was made the new Kahuna. Oh ho! Now that's a joy to my ears. Her old grandfather must be smiling down on us. Yes, Hapu will do her best for her late grandfather. As I must do my be best for my mother's sake and for Nebby as well. And, and so there's a place that, that we need to go. Executor Island. Executor Island. Oh, you mean the, where the flute is? Well, you two didn't meet the Kahuna already and pon Pony's captain ain't around anyway. So I guess there's no point weighing on any trials. Alright, the SS Magikarp will have you there and you'll think you're sailing in a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. Ha, here we are at Executor Island. I heard that this place used to be a trial site. Though that was a long time ago now. You go on. Good luck to you both. Let's go find that flute, right? Trainers really could go anywhere as long as they have their Pokemon, can't they? I think I'm beginning to understand the appeal. Alright, I get it. I'm coming. I'm coming. Of course, you could talk to the chief here to go, go back to the village. I feel like trainers could open up the door, door to any future as long as they have their Pokemon. That's what it looks like to me when I see you, you know, and Hapu and Hollow too. <sighs> ah, what was that, Yuna? It is a Nolan Exeggutor. The Alolan Executor Tours are both Grass and Dragon.
Exeggutor does, doesn't have a strong special defense, but I think this is the weakest I could hit him with. I mean the second weakest. Okay, one more sparkling Arya for good measure. Oh. Great ball, go. Yeah, I blew my chance on ca catching a, a Nololan Exegi to a Torrent Sun. But the Leaf Stones are really easy to come by. So I'm not wor worried about lo losing the chance of catching an, a, a Nololan Exegi Executor, the coconut Pokemon, Alola form. As it grew taller and taller, it outgrew its reliance on psychic powers. While within it, it awakened the power of the sleeping dragon. Yeah, the Pokedex Dex in, in Sunset says, This is how, how Executors were supposed, are meant to be, uh, are meant to appear as. Relaxed. Okay, here we go. Phew, that was an executor, wasn't it? I, I think I think that uh, that the good weather in the law has let it grow a bit more, more vigorously than I prefer. Oh, it started to rain. Rain in Alola, huh? My skirt got wet a bit. Looking out at the rain like this reminds me of this one time when I was little. I'd see it in the, seen it in the movie. This man singing and dancing in the rain. It captivated me so much that I had to try it for myself. My mother spotted me out in the rain and she was so shocked that she ran right out after me without even bothering to get an umbrella. And then she smiled and she danced with me in the rain. Of course, we both ended up catching a cold. She let me sleep in her big bed with her. I was so happy that I kept waking her again and again just to be sure it wasn't a dream. But then she changed. And all she would think about was the Ultra Beast. And Null and Nebby. They both ended up suffering so much. And I couldn't do anything. But you know what, Yuna? Whenever I feel like that there's nothing I could do, you seem to show up and you do something. Every time you show me that it's possible to do something. Even when the first time we met, Nebby was being attacked and all I could do was look on in horror. In that ether paradise, all I could do was wait for you and the others to save me. 
Whenever I'm in any sort of trouble, you're always there. I... Um, you know, what are you going to do once you finish your island challenge? Fill my Pokedex. Get stronger. It must be nice knowing what, what you want to do. I really admire that. I want to become a trainer and learn all the things you know, you know. Ah! Oh, cool. A rainbow. Maybe there really are good omens sometimes, when you say? Okay, where's Ho-Oh? I was gonna say, they should make a rainbow Pokemon, but... There already is a rainbow Pokemon, and that's Ho-Oh. Got a prism scale. You need that to evolve. Feebass into Milotech. Yuna, the flute is placed on a very old pedestal. Will you take the flute? Yes, what am I going to do? Just leave it there? Now we have both the sun flute and the moon flute. I don't know if we could really summon the legendary Pokemon, but we can at least try. If nothing else, we'll have sounded the flutes in offering like what people used to. So thank you for coming this far with me, Yuna. Let's go meet the chief at, of the Sea Folk and get back to Pony Island. Look at you, trial goer. You're going to the altar to play the flutes? The altar lies all the way through the vast Pony Canyon. It's a long road there. That path is like nature's own trial. Good luck to you, friends. And why don't you stop uh, by and tell Hapu that you, you're off before you go. Yeah, I'm just look, taking a quick look at the map. Okay, so... Where I need to go next is the front entrance of Pony Canyon. Save my game so far because not only am I almost out of a room in my SD card, but I want to be able to pace myself. Yeah, I ought to try to train some Pokemon over from uh, from uh, Moon to Sun and Sun to Moon. <sighs> well, thanks for watching, everyone. Till next time. To be continued, baby.